Is it gonna be the Tian Lang? What's gonna come out? Both them two points apart only, Evan. Look at that. How interesting. Only two points apart and fighting each other in the finals. Pre-bends the Wunsa, so he definitely wants turn one. Maybe a Triton's coming here and the Chungpung on that side. Uh, we didn't see it come too often. I'm kind of surprised. Um, I was expecting something different. Right, we haven't seen much Chungpung action tonight. Mm -hmm. And those two point, that yeah. two point deficit there is exactly why we the did Han. the ceremonial combat. It's out Han is here, about baby. It. So he's gonna probably bring the Gianna. This is the type of game that you know kind of what your opponent is doing. So he brings a 33%, which tells us there's a Triton coming and then another control option. Is it gonna be the Okeanos? Is it gonna be something different? And from this side, is it gonna be... Oh, he steals, he steals the, the Triton. Triton! That's huge, Very actually. smart. Now, what is he gonna bring? It has to be the Chiwo, maybe? And that's the only thing he can do? I I think that's the only other option that I'm remembering that has been presented from TARS so far. Yes. How to play. Are yeah, reading it is Chiwu Savannah. Chibu we Savannah. knew it. Chiwu Savannah, it's all going to come down to swift units. The question is, who is out of play going to bring late the Kinky? Kinky. Ooh. Still, let me tell you something. I really like the draft on TARS side because he can ban the strip and just go face. And if he stuns, if he manages to stun this Kinky, that's match. So the quest. Oh, he's probably banning the carnal, right? Uh, yeah, he's pro probably banning the carnal. We're gonna have to see. I'd love it if he banned the tri if he bans the triton here. That's huge. Mm -hmm. Or he could he'd do something silly and. Force because the it. the question is, if he does, yeah, yeah. triton was. <gasps> he did not ban the carnal. I think this is looking really, really good for Tars. But will this Nefty's resist the water Ryu once We've again and guarantee the match? Tonight. We've yeah. already seen that tonight. So how to play is banking on Moore's less viable like strat of stripping things. Hoping yeah. for a res from a Nefties. This is actually the exact same situation that he was mm -hmm. in. Very, very Not similar. Very, very similar. And the question now is, will the water Ryu hit it? Turn one is for him, as expected. Hit everything it on everyone. Death so breaks are gonna be huge. Can she reduce? Death break on all four. The bison is gonna hurt so much. Here comes Cardo. Stop the kinky. Pieces. This is a lockdown, Evan. This is over. Oh Savannah my MVP. god. Oh my god, what a death break. And let me tell you something, she's the MVP, but Water Ryu came to play. If he hit that strip, there was game right there. And this did not last long. Like we talked about, I love Tar's draft and the Elementals beat the, the LDs. LDs. Elementals coming in clutch again. That Carnal though, to lock down the team. We were talking about how maybe a ban on the follow-up might yeah. have been good there because having Savannah into a Carnal is a really bad recipe. Great adaptation because he got the Triton stolen, but he said, I'm gonna bring the Chi Wu, I'm gonna ban your fast monster, and I know I can outspeed because my water reuse is really, really fast. fast. But he banned everything on him. Moore says, I am speed. <laughs> Doing his best Leo impression. Mm -hmm. Always going first. And that's another thing. Maybe we'll see a Leo on the next matches because a Chiwu came out. So Ver Leo really strong into these comps because there's a Savannah on that side. So I, I would love to see a Ver Leo. But as we know, these guys like to be very aggressive, take turn one. So not a lot of reactive picks. And this is, again, a best of five. So these players actually get to know each other a little bit more than a best of three. So that can kind of be a little bit more with two O's. You can kind of feel your opponent out, get what they're trying to do with their strategy and adapt a little bit easier. Is the Savannah getting finally banned or the Carnal? Somebody's got to respect the Savannah. <laughs> Eventually, I, I don't think that's the ban. Did but you see that damage? Carnal hit so hard so with the artifacts. Carnal probably should have should have been the ban in the yeah. last one. But we'll see what happens in this next one. We're going into how to play versus Tars as round two of the finals. Now, first pick switches sides and the pre ban like we talked about. I don't know if how to place pre ban of the Chunk Punk did enough. So, Carnal or Savannah, more key to the comp. We know if you ban the Carnal, he's gonna probably bring the Oki. Mm -hmm. So, I don't know, maybe Savannah is the key. He brings, bans the Carnal. Ben on Nefty's on the other side. He knows it's a monster that normally built on 100% res. He still wants to go with the Water Ryu. Let's see if the first pick from how to play changes and he tries to steal a unit away like the Okeanos. Oh, it is Light Monkey right away. That would have been a nice pivot from how to play there because, like we said, Carnal does have kind of a replacement with Okeanos. They share similar tasks. Here comes Laura again. And he steals the Chi Wu this time. So we know that on that side, probably we're going to see a Savannah right now into a speed lead. And then last pick, Triton, right. or he's going to leave it for that side. Yep, There's speed lead from PSAM. PSAM's been doing great, yeah, by the doing way. Doing really well. He's thinking about it. Mm. 
thinking he has a king key as well. We know that that might come out. So if he doesn't have a stun, it's gonna be really, really Bad difficult. News. Yeah. Oh, oh Lulu? switches it. Lulu piece him? Like oh. game three, he's gonna bring that Savannah. You know the Savannah's coming out. And now finally Pontos right here. Immunity, speed lead, guarantees turn one. Mm -hmm. I don't is know about the Han. Uh, okay. oh, neither does how to play. I like that better. Ganymede, yes. Way better. Ganymede, oh, Ganymede and Monkey locked down really strong. And Ganymede Pontos really strong as well. This is almost a force ban on Pontos until the Juno's here. Wait, but wait, I still wait, think wait. I still think Pontos. I think he's gonna here. ban the monkey. You think he's gonna ban monkey? I think he's gonna ban the and monkey. And just go for the no follow-up because yeah. there's so little damage on that yeah. side. Ban the monkey! So he's just all like, I'll just great I'll just pivot. That's great, great pivot from Tars. Love it. He kind of called the ban right there, but he says, do you have enough damage to kill me? I don't think he's so. He's banking on no. Mm -hmm. He's really banking on no. I don't think so. You can put immunity, you can reset me. At one point, my Juno will destroy you. Here's my, my only fear is that there isn't enough strip on Tarz's side to deal with Pontos Gany ventilation. I don't know. He, I think he got this. I think he got this. This looks really good for him. Reduction, not hit on that. He needs to get the stun. Stun on Pontos. The Gany will get a reset right here. Very important. And if the Pontos procs, he can come back. Huge. Excellent. Excellent choice mm -hmm. to reset the Juno so that no she's, proc. she can't. No proc, strip. that's a dead Laura. Uh oh. Like I told you, this is game Evan. Laura's How gone. are you going to deal Laura's with this? Okiana's going to reset he right can't. now. This is game. Beautiful draft. Juno, really important right here to kill the monster. Is enough. Tar. He doesn't have damage. No damage He's left for how to play. What an outdraft. Another draft full of elemental net fives controlling the LD Master how to play. And all of a sudden, Tars is at match point. This is incredible against how to play against another legend tournament holder. Well, his name might be how to play, but we can start calling Tars how to draft. Draft. Because he definitely made that pivot, killed the strat by bringing Juno and banning the monkey. There was exactly. no damage. There's yeah. no way you can deal with it. It's over. Even the Pontos, if he put immunity up, it would have been gone. He has strip, he has the reset from Oki, the damage, even if he doesn't stun, it's so much damage. The Savannah's super fast. So that's what I said. The pre-ban on the Savannah would have been better than pre-ban on Carno because if you take his Carno, he's gonna bring Oki. Yes. So these two are interchangeable. But the Savannah is the AoE death break. Right. And that's, that's why the damage. That's why that light monkey in the first pick slot, like we I don't think we know if Tars has a light monkey. We haven't seen it presented mm -hmm. yet. If he's got one, I don't think. So picking light monkey first there would have been maybe an Okeanos would have been better to take mm -hmm. the substitute because then you're pre-banning Carnal and you're also essentially exactly. banning or stealing his replacement option. Let's go into game three. Again, Tars at match point right now in this best of five against how to play. Let's see if he continues with this great draft. Now the pre-bands are gonna go out. Probably Light Monkey pre-band. He does not want to play against that unit. I wouldn't either. Let's see what he does. Oh, Woosa. Okay. So the Light Monkey can come out. Tars with the first pick right now. Let's see what he decides. Is it the Carnal back in? And how interesting is that? How to play getting rid of the, the more? Or I like that. He, he thought that the more was the main thing. Yeah, one of his fastest sets. But now the thing is, ooh, ooh, ooh. switching from the Cardinal to the Okeanos. Very interesting. I like that. The Gianna comes out. Now is a very classic comp from how to play. The Hay Gang to counter her. <laughs> yeah, it's right like clockwork. Away. You see a Gianna Hay Gang comes out. And the Chunk Pong. I love that because we, oh, I like that, but he brings the speed lead to steal it away. Um, interesting. We the haven't monkey seen and how to play contest for that yeah. tonight, so. He's gonna have to bring another AoE strip and another source of control right now, otherwise he'll be in Triton trouble. But something. the thing is, that only has one speed lead. If he brings Triton Savannah, it's difficult, so he's gonna pivot. Lulu could go in here, but I, I don't know if it's really strong against what's going on because. And he's gonna be significantly slower mm -hmm. than how to play uh, if he's lacking. Might try to bring like P Sam again or something into this to, for the 33. Oh, oh, I like that better. Play the, Fire Ryu. Play the slower game. He's going to have to ban yeah. the damage uh -huh. and uh -huh. pray and pray for this because it's going to be difficult. Because if he bans the Hay Gang, there's not really a lot of ways to deal with this. Remember, you will glance on this monster, but the Light Monkey might still hit the control. Oh, he bans the Light Monkey. Monkey. Very interesting. We knew he was going to ban the Hay Gang. We knew that, so I think there's a big chance. I was afraid of that, 
because the Han goes through and the Han can destroy this fire Ryu. Yes, it can. I don't know if that was the, the and best. Nobody's man. on will. Yeah. Nobody's on will. Yeah, the Han is absolutely gonna melt these monsters. Mm -hmm. And there's a bomb here too. And death break from the Nefties. Oof. This is gonna hurt. This could be rough for Taurus, oh, but misses the death break. A proc here can change everything. Let's see, kills the Ciara, very smart. Cleaning it up, Ooh, going for a stun, stun on the Oki. But again, Tars can stand to lose this game because mm. they're two matches ahead of how to play right now. But how to play, presenting a really strong follow-up to yeah. what Tars was showing Ooh, before. Big proc, can wait. he kill the Han? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Diana. If this Diana kills the Han, everything changes and the match is over. That wait. is so much damage. This is huge. This is game. He can Diana, kill the Han right here. Diana can turn this With around. One transform solo from the Fire Ryu. What? what is this? How does he kill Fire Ryu? How hard did that Diana? He needs to hit the bomb. Hits the bomb. Here it comes. That better be a lot of damage. The Fire Ryu needs to recover. Let's see it. The bomb He's hitting. The solo. No, the, he doesn't have damage with the attack break. The bomb is gonna kill him, and how to play oh. is gonna take him. Back. Oh man, that. That was that was close. He needed that to resist that hope. bomb. Remember, bombs don't glance. Yeah. So he needed to resist that bomb. If he resisted the bomb, that would have been game, but nope. Wow, great job how to play. It gave us a little bit of hope there with that Diana proc, which yeah. was always interesting. A suspicious amount of da damage coming out of it. Yeah, what I was afraid of is she was hitting so hard that if she got an extra turn, she could vo go for Gianna, kill that. Or if she misses the bomb, game's over, but Gianna did not disappoint. And then Fire Ryu just would take the rest to go. Mm -hmm. yeah, but it was a great draft from How to Play. Really smart, really smart bands. We knew he had to ban the Hay Gang and everything, but it was it was just good. I think Tars might have been trying something out. See if they could get yeah. away with more of a bruiser style comp. Yeah. Let's see how they adjust going next. They're still at game point. Uh, how to Play is going to have to do that again if they want to stay in this final if match. If he tries to do something similar, he might want to ba ban the damage, the Han. Take the control from the monkey, you know, you have the chance to counterattack. But I think he was very afraid of the bomb, right? The monkey sleeps you, then if he hits her, right? And then the bomb from Gianna still comes in. So if he brings that team, I would love a Tetra. Because the Tetra counters Gianna so well and it counters the Light Monkey too. Because even though he reduced the attack bar, she can just take out that uh, that slow, slow exactly, slow which element. is the biggest thing. Yeah. It's surprising how relevant a Tetra would be tonight. There's How to Play representing the Kitty and Desheng again in that first pick slot. Uh, not sure if he needs to pick it that early. Like you could, again, this would be an opportunity where if, if they have Oki win, they could take mm -hmm. it. But I don't think we've seen Oki from them tonight. And goes again with a similar draft. He's comfortable. Goes with the Savannah that was notably missing. From last time. Uh, yeah, the charm. Bear that in mind. That actually could make the... We've seen this before. Yeah. Wait, we've seen this oh. draft. And I think How to Play might have just realized the same thing. We've seen how this plays out before. And taking the Triton is really important here. Because we know Triton into that Savannah and Oki oh, is Ah, but I don't know if I love this. I don't know if it means a victory Ban for How the to Play. Monkey. Ban, ban the monkey. Ban the monkey. I own oh, Makaku. It, he has triple strip, but not a lot of control damage. The CR you know, can, can, can hurt, but like... Yeah. Um, the CR needs to get very, very lucky right here. You can bring... Ooh, Leo, no, it's not a must ban necessarily. Maybe the Verd. I would like a triple revenge Verd right here, please, sir. That would Juno. be a good call. That's good, too. Fire unit versus this. You can ban the monkey or you can ban the Ciara. Either way is really good. But I do think that banning the monkey gives you a big advantage. You gotta take your pick. Do you wanna lose a monster right off the bat with the Ciara, or do you want to just lose turns with the monkey? Mm -hmm. And it's a lot of turns. It's yeah. not just one turn. It's, a, it's quite a few. And Tars is really taking their time to think, so it's so how to play here. Very interesting. He bans the monkey. It was kind of expected. He bans the Juno. I don't know if I'm in love with that. I still think that the key to this team right now is Okeanos. Yes. Because we've seen how we've seen how this works. Savannah set up the death break, big damage from Oki, control, like it's it's a little tough. Here comes the strip from Laura. Let's see if she can land it. Again, 120 base speed. She goes oh, for it. And gets it. Gets it, but the cut from the more if he reduces, does not reduce. Can he get the silence? They're trading the strips. Yeah, he needs silence. The silence. It's oh, really important. He pushes back and no misses. why? A silence no! even huge! Giannis with a lot of damage. Why? Oh, oh dude. The gets silence. reset. Savannah is gonna punish, reduces, and that's oh gonna be a God. lock. This that's silence. gonna be a lock. We talked about it. How important the Okeanos was. Why didn't he risk 
the silence, even though on a fire unit, it was needed right there. So but like we talked about, you pick a comp with three starters, three strippers, but not follow up. Ciara can't do everything alone. If you ban the monkey, there's no follow up. And that is game. Tars, Tars. with a beautiful ban right now, is gonna lock in his first ever legend, legend title. Tars is our champion in our season 18 RTA legend. Congratulations to Tars. Tars even taking a second to try out a slower bruiser comp in the middle of their finals game there. Kind of an interesting pivot. I'm glad they gave us a show like that. Very strong showing from them. Great draft. Love how he adapted. Amazing bands on every one of the matches from his side and the way that he adapted of having his monsters taken away, right? He right. had a plan, he stick to it. You take my Carnal, I'll go Oki. And once again, we did not see a ban on the key 